up guys this is Nico here with fightfearless.com I'm gonna show you I want to show you basic uh, defense or as far as the footwork moving backwards it's basic very basic in your shuffle so yeah understanding that when somebody attacks you or somebody's coming at you or, or moving in on you you don't want to just fumble back okay the reason being is you might trip over something right so somebody's coming at you and you try to stumble back with your feet like this just one important thing to know is the shuffle so if somebody's coming in on me this way then i want to have a basic stance or our, our fight stance which is our feet spread out wide now basically it would be like if you're standing hip distance apart and you just step one foot forward now you're in your stance so from that understanding when somebody's coming at me what I want to do is I would want to step back with my back foot put it on the heel and then you're going to shuffle back with that so again if somebody's coming in I'm stepping I'm opening my stance before I close it very important piece again that goes in any any movement at all if I want to move to uh, my right for you guys here then I'm gonna step with my right foot open it up and then close it to my stance if I want to move to my left then I'll open to close same thing moving forward I want to step with the front first front foot first if I'm moving backwards I step with the back foot first so again you may think that that's okay common knowledge but again these are things that we need to drill so your jab moving backwards the basic jab can do a lot of things. That could be punching them, it could be pushing away at their face, it could be pushing away at their face if they're trying to take you down to the ground, right? So pushing away and having that common connection of timing. When you jab, you step at the same time. So you're moving back, jab, 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 moving back. Again, jab, jab, doesn't matter which foot forward, right foot forward, jab, 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 moving back. Okay, so if we're doing it together, we want to step back, back, back with the back foot. If I'm using my left hand here, left foot, then I want to time it. You're going to shoot your front foot back to time that front hand. Again, if I'm moving backwards, I'm going to shuffle my back foot. So you're going to jump up and land with your front foot first. Again, that's to get the, the power and pressure off of that, that front hand. So moving back, jab. Jab, jab, again, moving forward. Ba, 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 moving back with the jab. Jab, jab, moving back. Jab, 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 moving back. So these are little things that you can drill at home. Again, it's just gonna help with you in the gym if you're at a boxing uh, gym or something like that, or you're working with a personal trainer or coach. These are just small little details that are gonna benefit you in learning, understanding boxing and striking for self-defense. So check out more, subscribe with me or like, please, and uh, follow me for more. I'd love to see some comments with the chair.